Well, Mike, the OCA has been reviewing procedures since December to make sure the right policies are in place to keep the kids of New Hampshire safe. Now, right now, when hospitals identify infants born exposed to drugs or alcohol, DCYF is brought in. They meet face to face with families as part of an assessment. But some complaints have come into the Office of the Child Advocate that the safety plans put in place for these babies have been insufficient. The office points to two cases in particular from last year where two babies were exposed and died, one of them 20 months old, the other 23 months old. DCYF had been assessing each of their families for neglect, but both cases were closed as unfounded. Now the OCA says it is trying to make sure the right procedures are in place. We want to take a look at this to make sure that DCYF has all the resources that they need and that we really understand these infants in terms of what they need and what risks they're at. Um, there's even a child or two who has died from um, what you might consider sort of natural causes, not necessarily abuse or neglect involved. Now that review is expected to be completed in July. Live in Concord tonight, I'm Sharice LeClaire, WMUR News 9.